Hey everybody, welcome back to the Shimoda Mailbag. Today we are going to discuss inserting a large DSLR core unit version 2 into an Explore 35 version 2 or an Action X50. I have received a few emails over time about this uh, and recently this week a gentleman was uh, struggling with inserting it in. So I just want to visually uh, demonstrate that it's not actually that difficult, it's just a matter of using the right technique to do it. So we're going to start with an Explore 35. Now, uh, let's just open it up and we'll want to have the bag positioned uh, so the hinge is away from us. We'll take a large DSLR core unit. We're going to do it full. You can do it empty, uh, which is a little bit easier because the core unit will have a little more flexibility. But uh, we'll keep it like this just to uh, show you that it is possible and it is not that difficult. You'll want to take the core unit. You'll notice that there's a deeper end and a shallower end. Of course, the deep end goes to the top of the backpack and the shallower end goes to the bottom. The backpack is shaped to fit uh, this, this profile perfectly. So when it drops down, it will have kind of a wedge that sits in the bag uh, and this should not come out or move. When you're putting it in, start with the hinge side and you'll see right here, I am just gonna drop it and I'm gonna kind of lightly put it under the frame here and then I'm just gonna kind of slowly push it forward and then I'll pick a corner, I'll start down here and then I'll go to this corner and plop, it's in there just like that. And now it's not gonna be perfectly in right away. You're gonna have to take your finger and just kind of uh, lightly wiggle it so the frame of the backpack sits over the rim or the frame of the core unit, just like this. And that's really it. That was really quick and easy. Just a couple of hand motions here and there uh, and it's in there. So now the core unit will drop down a bit once the pack is upright, just like this. It's comfortably placed inside the pack. Again, the uh, backpack frame should sit over the core unit frame and that wedge profile that I spoke about will keep the core unit in place. So I hope that helps with anyone who was previously struggling with putting a large DSLR core unit in an Explore 35 or an Action X50. We'll see you next time on the mailbag. Take care. Mm -hmm.